In this video, I wanted to take a look at the KUU LabBook Pro, a 2-in-1 laptop and tablet that has good specifications, a premium build, and it offers a lot of versatility. At the time of this video, the device costs about 800 bucks, but make sure to check out the video description for the latest prices. The LabBook Pro comes with quite a few regional keyboard stickers, some paperwork, USB Type-C cable, a fast 45W PD charger, and a stylus. First of all, the LabBook Pro has pretty good specifications that include Intel Kaby Lake Core i7 8550U CPU, 16GB of RAM, and 512GB of fast SSD storage. A few words that best describe the device, versatility and portability. This is a 2-in-1 device that comes with a really nice, evenly backlit and comfortable to type on detachable keyboard. Well, there is a little bit of wobble and flexing going on, but I found the keys to be tactile and I started typing fast on the keyboard in no time. In other words, the Lubbock Pro offers good typing experience no matter if you use the device on the desk or on your lap. You can also adjust the angle of the keyboard for convenience. The trackpad is responsive and comfortable to use for browsing the web or doing any other stuff. You can also use the supplied stylus for the touchscreen to do the same stuff as you would do with your fingers, but if you like drawing or taking notes, you'll definitely find it useful. Once you are done using it, you can conveniently store it on the keyboard thanks to the strong built-in magnet. You can adjust the angle of the display thanks to the built-in metal made kickstand on the back of the main unit. Once you fold the keyboard, you get a very portable yet fully functional Windows 10 laptop which is very convenient for traveling. Take the main unit out of the keyboard and you have a tablet with a massive 12.6 inches touchscreen display. I found the 2K resolution screen quality to be very good. It is sharp, it's vibrant, and its viewing angles are good. The display is quite reflective, but nothing out of ordinary, just like all glossy panels. The build quality of the main unit is just top-notch. It is made completely out of metal and it sports Apple-like craftsmanship. Very premium and well-crafted device. The keyboard also looks and feels premium and its outer shell sports this pretty cool looking design. On the left, we have two USB Type-C ports and a speaker grill. On the right, there is a headphone jack, a volume rocker, and another speaker grill. Even though the tablet has a dual speaker system, the sound quality is just mediocre. It sounds kind of flat and the volume output could be much better. Here is a quick audio test. On the top of the main unit, we have the ventilation grill. The fan does not spin all the time, but when it does, it's quite audible. There is also a power key that doubles as a fast and accurate fingerprint scanner. The tablet has 5 megapixels camera on the front and an 8 megapixels camera on the back. The quality may not be the best, but it's definitely usable for video chats or recording a quick video. This is a video and audio test using the front-facing camera of KUU Labook Pro. This is a video and audio test. One, two, three, one, two, three. Attaching the tablet to the keyboard is super fast and easy thanks to strong magnets. The LabBook Pro comes with a Windows 10 Pro pre-installed. I found day-to-day -day performance to be near excellent. The device feels fast and responsive pretty much all the time. I'm not a big gamer, but I found that the device performs great in titles like Asphalt 9 or 8. Other daily tasks like browsing the web, social media, editing documents work like a breeze. Very smooth overall performance. When it comes to battery life, the unit has a 5000 mAh power bank. 
On average, I could get about 4 or 5 hours on a single charge, which is a pretty good result considering that I use maximum screen brightness most of the time. Overall, the Lebook Pro exceeded my expectations and I like it for many reasons, but let's summarize all the pros and cons. The loudspeaker quality is quite disappointing and the volume output is low. Also, the fan noise is quite audible at times, but that's not going to be an issue for most users. Now, the pros. I love a premium design, excellent build quality, the touchscreen display is nice and sharp, the backlit keyboard is comfortable to type on, the fingerprint scanner is fast and accurate, the supplied stylus is convenient for taking notes or drawing, and the overall performance of the device is great. It just feels fast and smooth pretty much all the time when doing basic everyday stuff. Last but definitely not least, I love the versatility and compact size of this device. I can take it with me as a full-fledged Windows 10 Pro laptop or simply use it as a tablet when I don't need the keyboard. All things considered, the Labbook Pro is a high-quality 2-in-1 Windows laptop and tablet despite a few shortcomings. What do you think about this device? Would you buy this one or would you choose another option? As always, like the video if you liked it, please ask me any questions in the comment section and as always, it was Lionus, thank you for watching and see you soon.